In this video, I'm going to show you how to line a tray bake tin. A tray bake tin is a shallow rectangular tin um, which can be used for doing tray bakes like brownies or it can be used for unbaked things as well like Rice Krispie Crunch or Naomi bars. What I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it upside down and I'm going to line it with baking parchment and I want to cut my baking parchment so it's just longer than the tin and I need to take into account the sides of the tin. So about there is going to be long enough. Then I'm going to fold in about four or five centimetres on one side of it. That just needs to be slightly deeper than the height of the tin and I'm going to rest it on top of the tin just slightly in from where the curve is on the tin and then I'm going to fold in the other long side so it's just slightly inside the curve. The inside of the tin is slightly smaller than the outside because you've got the thickness of the metal. Now that side you can see is a lot wider than that side so I'm going to cut this side down so that both flaps that come in are a similar length. So that bit is rubbish. And I'm going to fold in one end. And I'm positioning it on the tin again just in from the curve. So then I'm going to fold the other end in. Now I did cut the paper a little bit too long here, so I'm going to cut that down. So that should be just the right size to fit in my tin. So what I need to do now is to cut along where the lines were folded. So on the two long sides I cut in where the um, crisscross is on the sides. So it's cutting on the line of the fold right up to the point where the lines cross. Then when you lift it up it should fit neatly into the tin. So that will make it easy to turn out whatever it is I'm making in the tin.